Let's be honest, the default landing pages and the app design that you get out of Lovable and Bold, they look like trash. And it looks like it's been, you know, built and rushed by someone who just hates design, spacing, colors. And, you know, he's like in some kind of rush, right? And we all have shipped our embarrassing first version of our app landing page, uh, you know, just to get something live. And, you know, it stings when you see someone, you know, uh, who is like shipping and building and designing uh, an application or a landing page using Lovable and Bolt, which looks, you know, rich in UI and US, uh, UX perspective. And I have been in that position wherein, uh, because I was part of Bolt Hackathon, right? And by the way, I won the hackathon. I came on the A version uh, using the same framework that I'm going to be sharing with you. So, you know, I used to be on X and I used to see like people are launching and their app looks really good, really sleek, modern design. And my app basically looks something like this. Now, this is not my app, but this is what my design look like, right? Uh, so that's why, you know, I got tired of all this, you know, and I built something that fixes it. So here's what I built. So I built a wipe code UI kit. So what this UI kit basically does, it gives you a prompt, efficient and detailed prompt for each and every UI component and the marketing blocks. So what do you get in this UI kit? So in this UI kit, you get 50 plus UI components from announcement, call to action, heroes, footers, uh, as you can see over here, badges, cars, date pickers, file uploads, breadcrumbs, everything, every little elements that you need in your application or on your landing page is in the UI kit. At the same time, like I mentioned, we have 20 plus marketing blocks. So marketing blocks are basically uh, are blocks used in your landing page. So for it, can, it could be hero section, feature section, uh, the testimonial, right, uh, FAQs, all that stuff. And I'm running a early bird discount only for you guys. So this offer uh, is for only next 48 hours. Uh, so grab this only for 59 Canadian dollars and you get access to all of these UI components and blocks and guides as well. And you get lifetime access. So it's just one time payment because I don't believe in having a monthly subscription or a yearly subscription for this. Uh, so, you know, uh, just grab this offer if you are really serious about, uh, you know, building something using wipe uh, code tools out there. Now I'm going to give you a demo of how you can use our UI kit and you can build something from this and build something this, right? So I'm just going to switch to, this is how, this is what the app looks like. So you get UI components over here. We have, uh, you know, a la carte of all the UI components over here, right? And then we have marketing components as well, as you can see, testimonial, pricing section, navigation, features announcement and everything and then you get access to these guides as well so in this guide what i do is i share my own you know hacks uh, or you can say tips and tricks about how you can be a god at you know white coding so what i'm going to do i'm just going to create a small section right so for this i'm just going to use this hero section so what i believe is going in an incremental fashion Right? Don't just tell Bolt or Lovable to like build me this, this, this app. That's what 90% of people do. Instead, I what I did in the Bolt Hackathon is I went section by section. So I went from one section, hero section, then I went to a next section, and that's how I kept on incrementing and building my application. Right. So uh, for my hero section, right, for my this use case, I'm gonna use this example, right? And my UI kit supports Lovable and Bolt as of now. But if you need uh, some other wipe code tools out there, just drop a comment and I'll, uh, you know, integrate that as well. For this use case, I'm using Bolt. So I'm just going to click on Bolt, copy the prompt over here, and I'm going to head back over here and be like, uh, build a hero section for a finance news letter landing page use this script right and i'm gonna paste the prompt over here i'm gonna scroll down right enter and what i do usually 
is I keep on every time I, you know, tell Bolt or Lovable to design something, I use a color code, right? So I'm just going to flip over here, copy this, and this is the color scheme or color palette that I'm using for my example over here. I'm a huge fan of dark UI, so that's why I'm using this. Uh, I'm just going to fix this a little bit. Yeah. Background color, group, and border. And yeah, we are good to go. Yeah. Uh, also, uh, I'm going to be adding uh, Figma templates as well, so you can easily you know, integrate your Figma. Uh, then you can move your design from Figma to Bolt Alloyable, right? So I'm soon planning to, uh, you know, like publish all the Figma files uh, in this UI kit, right? So just grab it if you are really serious about, you know, wipe coding. If you want to build something really clean, modern uh, design, right? So yeah, uh, I'm just going to fast forward this section because I don't want to bore you guys. Oh, I think it worked. I yeah it worked there you go and the amazing feature is that all these components that i use in my ui kit are consistent so other platform what happens is you know it's a marketplace so there are different creators who are using different components and you like a particular component and you use it and what happens is now the font of this might be enter then you use a different component and the font over there might, might be you know something else and then you know the consistency of your landing page or your app it just down uh so yeah so over here in my ui kit everything is consistent i'm using the same font same structure same layout everything is well perfect and responsive as well so yeah this is what it built and you know using the ui kit you are going to be saving a lot of tokens right because what happens is you tell uh, bolt a level to build something it builds something by default and then you exhaust your tokens right and reconnecting or restructuring each and every element like from this uh, badge from for the headline tag cta and all that stuff so what happens is you're saving your tokens right and then you can utilize that token somewhere else but yeah it created something like this which looks clean to me right uh i yeah so yeah so that's what you get using our white code UI kit. So don't waste your time. I'm done. I'm just running this offer for 48 hours. Just grab it. It's a one-time payment for lifetime access. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the demo and I hope you liked my product as well.